Howdy folks and welcome back once more to Let's Play Might and Magic 2. As per usual, we are just jumping on here. Today, we are going to get Goldie Leaf for plus because damn it, I'm tired of fussing with it. So, we want to head south. We're going to cap everybody's speed. I was thinking about it. Like, the only reason I've not really invested too much, actually, we want to... I think we want to go east, if I recall correctly. I'm, I'm th I was thinking that the... Where do we want to go? I'm trying to remember where the speed place. I think it was south of Volcania. So actually, let's see, what is it? Eight, four? And Volcania, I think, is town four. Maybe. Is this the exit? Yes, all right. So maps, towns, Volcania. Oh my God, seriously, game? Like I've got, I've, I've mapped it, but for whatever reason, it won't load the map unless I'm actually like in town. Cause like, I just want to leave. And there, go to link sheet. There we go. So from here, we want to go south. Shit, it's further south than this. Is it seriously E3 we want to go to? I think it's E3. I don't know. All right, well, our destination lies to the south. So I'm going to see, because this is the desert, and it's going to like just, oh, Oh, we made it. Okay. Is this the one? Yeah. Because we want to go down... Oh, is it right here? Yeah, the Nomadic Rift Cave. Alright, oh, it teleported me. Alright, just plop me down in the corner. That's actually where I wanted to be. So let's just avoid... Oh my god, seriously. I just wanted to step into one square. We've got, like, people in the back row are dead. Oh my god. Fucking traps on the overland. I'm just stepping all over them because I'm attempting to avoid taking, they're not taking damage. I'm just not paying attention to my character's health. All right, gold leaf. Seven, four on dark mage. Seven, four on fucking rove. Everybody rest. Into the cave. Okay, so. I want to try two things here. First off, we're going to have to get through a fight. Actually, no, we won't. One square forward. All right, I want to know if I'm standing here and I cast and go one square forward, does it? It does loop. Nice. Okay. So we're going to step onto the treadmill. I want to have Dark Mage cast two, six, and we're going to set a Lloyd's Beacon here, right? So now what I'm going to do is have Gold Leaf town portal us 8-4 to town and then we're just gonna have dark mage <laughs> fucking teleport us back do this and we're just gonna do this cuz laziness oh wrong spell ah accidentally threw some Resistances. All right. I think that should be everybody in the 40s. Oh, I don't know. That's everybody in the 50s, except for Gold Leaf. Uh, we're actually going. We are going to do it one more time because um, it will get her to a 69, which I will take. Back to town. Dark Mage. Two six and teleport. And there we go. So now we'll rest, wasting shed loads of money. Oh no, she's still only a 59. Damn. Well, no, 50. God, I can't math. 49 plus 10 is not 69, it's 59. Jesus Christ. Okay, so now, uh, gold leaf cast 84. Back to middle gate. Okay. So we're gonna go save. Yes. All right. Go ahead and exit just so that it takes. And we're going to just completely nuke out the party here. And we're going to add Harry Carry. And we're going to add Gold Leaf. I do not want to exit to DOS, even though I try to do it every time. Okay, make sure it takes. Are we good? We are, I think, as good as we're going to be. So we go to the overworld. And I can just actually navigate us to Korax Cave here. Okay. Oh, cast. Get light going. All right, maps, caves, Korax cave. Okay. If this doesn't work, I don't know what we're gonna do. All right, so unlock. We step forward. Our admit it pace. It admit eight pass is taken. Step forward. So goal leaf should go first. They surprised us. 
She goes first. Cool Leaf doesn't care. Holy word. Eradicates everything. Same thing. Holy word. Eradicates everything. Have a nap. Cast light. Turning. Oh, wait, no, we have to dismiss Harry Carry. Barriers are dropped. Alright. Suddenly we are attacked. Attack them. Okay. 9 2. Alright, we have eradicated them. We reunite Korak's soul with his entombed body and he arises before us. Thank you for freeing me. Go to Mount Fairview to gain your reward. Also, I have advice for you. All encasement spells are one square away and one square away from the most distant corner of each elemental plane. Okay. And there's nothing here. And she's, seriously, she's locked in. Bash it? There she goes. Okay, I'm just navigating her out. We are like beelining out of here. 8 4, back to middle gate. Ah, oh, saved! Alright, so Goldleaf is ready to get her plus. Um, I'm trying to think about who else we could do. I think we could do. We could try to do swells. I don't know if he's gonna be able to fight the Frost Dragon. Like, that's a hard fight. But he has that plus fucking a million flail, so I think he'll probably be okay. So we're gonna send Swell and Dark Mage out. Dark Mage is along purely for convenience. Alright, uh, we're in Middle Gate. Because I think... I don't think it's too long a walk. It's like a couple maps away. We're gonna have to take the, the ferry, I think. Because... <laughs> Because we're fucking plebes and we can't water walk. Although I'm pretty sure Swell probably could. Alright. So was it here? I think? Oh, uh, we're not gonna be able to walk through the trees. Shit. Um. Can we bash through them? No. That is troublesome, and it's all because of Dark Mage. So can you cast? Yeah, well, you can cast Light here. This this band. Seriously, you're a Pathfinder. That should let you get through these. Or is that mountains? Might be mountains. Shit. I don't suppose. Uh uh uh. Okay, I think we we might be able to get in there. Go to Link Sheet. Let's have a look see. I just need to step like- Ah, I was gonna say, I just need to step like right there, and it's not gonna let me. Oh, and we don't have an auto-mapper in the party either, which is... Mildly concerning. Man, they were just like making me take a path. Just run. Alright. They- they wanna fucking fight Swell with his magical murder mace, that's on them. An hourglass? What does that do? Uh, I would say haste. Time stop? Time distortion, maybe? Time distortion, alright. I'm actually, I think, gonna have him hold on to that. We'll go ahead and rest. Well, shit. Because I think it was this cave. Okay, we'll go back to middle gate. Seriously? Wait, he can actually... Swell, I think, can cast Water Walk. Yeah. Okay. That's not so bad. Alright, we're back in middle gate. <sighs> Dark Mage, I am gonna bring you along because... Do you have... You don't have any skills. I think only half your party needs to be able to... I think only half your party needs... Motherfuckers, they both had it! Oh my god. No. And this is mountaineering. Maybe everybody needs it, but then he should have been able to go through it. I don't... Uh, whatever, just flee. No. We can walk this. We should be able to just like fucking. Yeah, now we can. Oh my god. 
Whatever. Alright, Cavaliers are magic immune, so I am going to... Throw a power shield. Swell is going to just butcher these things. Yeah. Alright. So is this the right place? Yes. Wonderful. Okay. So we're gonna rest. We're gonna dismiss... I'm not gonna dismiss Dark Mage. Not yet. Oh, no. oh combat only. Alright. Um... Protection for magic? Yeah, I should have brought a cleric with us, but we don't have a hireling cleric. I was gonna say, cast up protection from elements. Actually, Swell might be able to do that. Can you? Yeah, alright. Alright! This is Swell's penance. So he'll get 250 hit points and he's fast as fuck. One shot at Swell. Oh, you tried. Ooh. You have proven yourself worthy, now return to the jurors of Mount Fairview. Search. You bet your asses I'm opening this thing. I'm gonna laugh if this kills him. Now. 21,000 gold and some gems, though. I'll take it. Swell, so, can you cast? I wonder if he can cast. Ah, oh, no, he can't cast Town Portal. I think that's only clerics. Alas. That's okay. Okay, so we're gonna rest. Get the fuck out of here. No. No. Yeah, what's up with that? He can't go through the trees, even though he's a Pathfinder. That is weird. Like, I don't know what would cause that. I got nothing. Alright, thankfully, we're just gonna go this way until we get into a fight, and then we're just gonna run. Oh no. So I was gonna have to murder some innocents. Eh, maybe not. So I was having a bad time of it. So he just ran. I'm surprised they put him down. Well, almost put him down. Cast. Three, six. Now we can just walk across. Okay, back to town. So those, let's see, I'm trying to think. I think we've seen Devon's, but I don't remember where he was. Um, I don't know where everybody else's are, actually, now that I think about it here. Gold leaf. No, I always hit escape. Uh, eight, four, take me to Atlantium. Is this Atlantium? I don't think, this is fucking Sanzibar, isn't it? Yeah, yes. Why is five Sanzibar? Two is Atlantium. Barely. Yeah, this is Atlantium. Weird. Alright, the reason that we're here, I just want to pop in because we have the map notes that tell us things. Okay, so we don't have robbers. The Dread Knight resides at B3. Alright. A knight must defeat him. Many have tried, all have failed. Uh, Baron Wilfrey's lair is in B2. I... I'm not going to bother getting... Well, I, I could bother getting drogs. I guess. Sure, why not? Alright, we're not gonna do it now, though. I wanna get us back to Middlegate, get the, get the gang back together, as it were, here. Because we have, we have mapping to do. Because, like, it's asking me to go to areas that I'm fairly certain I have not been yet. And I'm not gonna just like beeline for these places how are we looking on money eh, we're not bad not as bad as we could be uh, that having been said I do want to go and get those of us that can get them our pluses I just have to remember where fucking Mount Fairview was uh, I know we've been there I'm just gonna Let's see, Castle Woodhaven. I'm just like reading the maps here, so I don't think I'm like, oh. Royal Territory, all right, so it's to the east. I think, I think this is where we want to go. Okay. So we'll just take the ferry across and we'll, to Lux's Palace, that's, sounds appropriate. Then we're gonna have to figure out how to get like where we want to, like where we want to be. Okay, and then, it was way the hell back here. Yes. 
So you want to enter. All right. Go to the link sheet. So yeah, the only thing we've done in here is find the Bishop of Black Battle. You do not want to leave. I suppose, ah, uh, fucking run away from that. Great Hall. Sumptuous feast is laid upon the huge banquet table. Take some? Sure. What did it do? Oh, give us a bunch of food. All right, well, that was nice. Work bought a pet rock. It ran away the next day. God, fucking jesters. Throne room, throne room. Forex study. Oh, really? Wind and Korax apprentice is busily packing away his belongings before he goes to Lord Peabody's. He says that Korax's body is hidden in the cave and Korax's soul is at yada yada yada. Well, we already figured that out. Further, why is dust covers everything? Port wizard, dust covers everything. Alright. This route Queen Lamondo wails. Whilst my courtiers are merry, a heavy burden I must carry. If only you gained your plus and won the triple crown. Yeah. We have to go talk to... Fuck, who is it? I don't remember. Like, Princess Lamada, I think. We can actually probably check. Ah, uh, Queen Lamada. We have to speak to her, which we have actually just did, but we don't have our pluses yet. Um... Theoretically, we've already done the Black Triple Crown. Oh, uh, where is get our plus? The quest log is being less than helpful. Okay, we actually have to go to Mount Fairview. I'm a dumbass. Mount Fairview is actually in this area. We just have it. We've walked past it. Mystic Clown. All right. Um, I don't know what these things are, so I'm just gonna implode them. Oh, they don't. I was gonna say they don't have a lot of health, but they juggle. And ugh. the funny room is a place of evil and sadism. Oh, they surprised us. It's okay. We have melees. Of here, Korax study, dust covers everything. Apprentice wizard. Oh, pfft. all right. Uh, where's Fantastic Freeze? Actually, no, Dancing Sword. Yeah. Like these things. What are they gonna do? Energy blast me? Oh no. Alchemist. Palace Alchemist chamber contains piles of gold made for treasury. Steal some. Nah. We're not thieves. Oh, I just walked into something. I, I double tapped. That's okay. It's just a bunch of mans at arms. They have 20 hit points. So what is this? Oh, the barracks. Fair enough. Fool's room. Fool, how, I'm not even... I, what a twist. It's full of fools. I would have never guessed. <laughs> I do not want to leave yet, though. Nothing? Oh. Oh. Is there going to be something horrible? Stairs to the dungeon. All right, well, now we know where those are. Is there anything over here? Truly? Well, Dark Mage, this might be a bad idea. Alrighty then. <laughs> Random little dark room, sure. Fighting room, temple. Uh, no signs on the doors. All right, let's straight in. A little princess plays with an A1 toddler. Take it. Yes. We need that. Trade item with row. A1 toddler. I think that's three of them. I don't know. We've only got two of the parts. Alas. Steal, it's like stealing high tech from babies. All right, these guys invoke power. I don't know what that means, but I fear it. So fireballs. Not oh, Stefan. I gotta get used to new attacking order again, like for my casters and stuff. A slumber club? I assume it just casts sleep, right? Yes, it casts sleep and it actually gives you sleep resistance. So I guess that's worth something. Oh, we're so fast it doesn't matter. 
Brown's chain mail. Oh! <laughs> Royal Horsemen are pretty beefy. Thug Trainees are dumpsters. Fire Devils throw fireballs. We're gonna try this because I wanna see um, how well protection from elements works, like whether or not it's actually worth it. Alright, so do we have any magic resistance? Yes! Uh, but Dancing Sword should cut through. I'm gonna say just about everything. Dancing Sword is a really good spell because it deals physical damage and. Rarely do enemies have, well, I should say, rarely do enemies that have magical resistance specifically have physical resistance as well. God damn it, Rove, of course you don't have it. Um, these real horsemen have no magic resistance, but look like they might have some sleep resist. So, Rove, hit them with Mega Bolts. Devils, too? Yeah! Those devils, I was gonna say, the devils worry me because they fireball. I'm gonna trust this to my melees. Because these things each have like fucking 16 hit points. Uh, oh wow, only 8 damage like from those fireballs. That's pretty tame. A Scorch Maul plus 4 and a Staff plus 8. I think that wasn't even a marked encounter on the map. I think that was just like a a random fight that we just happened to kind of bump into. Which paladins? Um, I'd say I feel bad for what I'm about to do to these guys, but I really don't. And then my melees are just gonna turn them into mulch. Icicle and a barish. Oh my god! Seriously, game. Yeah, I mean, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. Uh, do you guys range? You do not. Oh, they have ranged attacks, but they don't fringe the. Which I guess that's the, the primary thing that I'm worried about. All right, and then the melees should have those. That was fucking good money, and a might gauntlet plus five. What's the alignment? And of course, it's evil, so none of us can use it. I mean, Rove might be able to. I think he might be evil. Stone Hammer plus three. What is that? Stone Resistance. Uh, magic Resistance. And it does a D18 damage. Uh... I can actually give that to... I'm actually going to give that to Drog, assuming we can actually use it. Who has that chunk? Yeah, it's unaligned. Uh, stone hammer. Barbarians can use it. All right, so draw. Just, just drop all this. It's all crap. Uh, chunk trade item. The draw the stone hammer. Remove your bardish and equip that. Nice. Draw got an upgrade. Not a substantial one, but an upgrade nonetheless. I'm just gonna fucking dancing sword these guys, soften them up for the rest of the party. God, those things are worth a shitload of money! 30,000 gold pieces times six. Fuck. That is absurd. I mean, they're kind of nasty, I guess, but dancing swords. And I'm gonna hit them with some fiery death here as well. Alright, we should have this. Yeah, th that pack just dropped 171,000 gold pieces. And a thief's pick plus two. Target room. Fort Bowman. Hey, these guys are worth 20,000 experience points apiece. Well, they got 150 hit points. This would be like a good place to train at lower levels. Like, they attack a lot, but their damage isn't great. So, like this would probably be a pretty reasonable fight for like some characters in like the teens. You just gotta survive to get here, I guess. Cause like those dwarves and stuff are pretty nasty. So is this it? I'm just gonna auto attack through this. Like these guys aren't. These guys aren't really much of a fight. Yeah. All right. Um. Secret. I oh, don't know, that's just gonna be the other fucking fool's room. Why did I not ex explore any of these? 
chance sword. That's luck. I'm sure these are all just gonna be, yeah, just... I'm not even gonna bother looting. It's all just trash. I was gonna say, it's all just trash encounters. These iron wizards actually aren't that bad. They only have 80 hit points. I, like, famous last words. They're not that bad. I mean, they throw fireballs, which is kind of rough. And also, they appear to be immune to melee damage. All right, let's see. Are you immune to megavolts? You are decidedly not. And we got some gems for that. All right, here, let's go ahead and rest. More illusionists. Man, that's like a hell of a jump. You go from these like dumpster tier illusionists to, hey, iron wizards, which are really just mostly obnoxious. And I guess they drop gems. So that counts for something. I apparently missed the door. More iron wizards. Megavolts is a good spell, you guys. What do you have up here? Court mages. All right, these are a little bit beefier. 100 hit points, and they cast Super Shock. Which that we will feel like pretty good, I think. Um. Dancing sword them. As I was gonna say, if it doesn't kill them, it's gonna soften them up. Iron corals, a little bit of money, some gems, nothing too interesting. More current mages. I bet we can just like, yeah, as I was gonna say, we can just auto attack. There's only three of them. If there were like, I don't know, eight of those guys, that would probably be a hell of a fight, and I wouldn't really want to get into it. But as it stands, we're okay. All right, so this square right here, I'm curious. What is it? <laughs> of course! You chuckle fucks throwing jester closets into the game. Same thing, I assume. Yeah. Oh, we gotta fight these. You got fireball should... Oh, and they're fucking magic immune. Just enough magic immune to be a pain in the ass. All right, this is actually a pretty good source of gems. All right, cast. Okay, I just want to step in here just to kind of like get it mapped a little. Oh, it's a secret in through here. Nice. All right. So let's. Where did this come from? I was just turning. This is like the most motley crew of enemies. It's like Pegasi, which are like you know good creatures, cavorting with vampire rats and mummies. What? <laughs> All right. Um, nine two. Can we eradicate those mummies? Yes, we can. Oh man, the rest of you guys are fucked. Maybe now. Well, now they are because Rove's gonna hit them with mega bolts. Assuming our melees don't kill them all. God, that spell is good. We got a little bit of money and some gems. A little bit of money. It was like 70,000 gold. <laughs> Whatever. All right. Back to the, the main map here. Uh, or not. It's not letting me go. Let's try this again. Where are we? I think we're on D2. Yes. All right. So we're looking for something, I think, out here. I just don't know where it is. So, why is Swell unconscious? What even? How are we looking on my- Okay, we are good on money. Almost a million and a half gold pieces. So, gold leaf. 8-4, takes to Atlantium. We're gonna go ahead and pop in on the trainer really quick. I'm gonna sell stuff. Uh, and then we're probably gonna call it here. And next time we can see about getting our pluses. How's everybody looking? We actually made some good experience in there. Like, I should say this episode. Gold Leaf can level. Nice. Dark Mage doesn't count. Ooh, Gold Leaf, she, I was, Gold Leaf just hit level 23, but she doesn't get any new spells. She has all of her spells. Ah, to be excited about spell levels again. Okay. Uh, we we're basically just gonna vendor everything. Essentially every God, those mic gaunt that, that pisses me off about those mic gauntlets. I'm not even gonna lie. It's like broadsword. Uh yeah. Alright. Back out of here. Let's go to the inn and save. 
And with that, I think I'm going to call it. So, as per usual, folks, thank you for watching. I hope you all had a good time. Uh, I will see you guys next time. We're in... Uh, we see about hunting down those jurors, and we might poke at a couple more pluses. We'll see. Until then.